Hey, today we will look at and take measurements of the characteristics of Friedstein Aldrich satin. Let's make a measurement of the hardness of the compound with a durometer. As always, I will take three measurements and get their average. If tread softer, that tire more comfortable has better grip but shorter tread life. So, first measurement is 63, second 63, third 62 and average 62.7. As you can see from our comparison chart, this is not soft but not hard compound. Let's weigh the tire. If the weight is low, then the tire is more economical, I mean fuel, and gives an increase in dynamics and due to the balance of sprung and unsprung masses is more comfortable. Weight in this size 10.3 kg and it's a light tire. And now the tread depth. It determines how much water the tire can remove from the contact spot at the moment and with the hardness of the rubber compound determines how long tire will last. You can see that the tread depth is 7.5 mm and it's a good for passenger car tire. The sidewall elasticity is medium. The sidewall thickness is one of the characteristics showing how durable the tire and the norm is from 5 to 8 mm. Here 7.2 mm. The thread is asymmetrical with wide drainage grooves and small grooves that help with drainage and grip due to the edge effect. But it has not enough small grooves for maximum effect on the wet. So this tire has maximum performance on dry. However, you can see on the label excellent grip on the wet, but the same excellent marks on different tires does not mean same braking or grip. Also you can see good rolling resistance that means good fuel economy and normal noise level. So this tire is engineered for fast driving, but best performance will be in the dry conditions. Thank you for watching, like this video and subscribe for my tire channel. Bye.